Hey everyone and welcome back. So I wanted to do a news update because we definitely have uh, some title announcements that are very, very cool. One of which literally just got announced. I think it was speculated for a little bit, but even then I didn't want to get my hopes up, but it actually has been officially announced and I am super, super excited about it. But I'm going to get to that one in just a moment. First up, a couple I've been meaning to get since they were announced. So let's cover these real quick. Uh, first up from Kino is a, a new release of Mario Baba's Planet of the Vampires. This one's definitely overdue and it's getting a a new 2K restoration of the film, a new audio commentary track with critics Kim Newman and Barry Forshaw, and then ports over uh, some stuff from the previous, I think, MGM release, I think, with an audio commentary by Mario Baba Bayard for Tim Lucas, an alternate music score highlights, original Italian opening credits, the trailers from Hell with Joe Dante, trailers from Hell with Josh Olsen, a theatrical trailer, and it will have a limited edition uh, slipcase for usually for like the first pressing. That is coming July 26th and retails for $29.95, but obviously you just got announced, so I will get a little bit cheaper as it gets closer to release date, depending on where you ordered from. Now, if you want the slipcover, you probably want to grab it right away, but if it doesn't, slipcover doesn't really mean that much to you. Sometimes you may want to do what I do, which is usually wait for when Kino has some of their sales. That's when I usually kind of grab a lot of Kino stuff because their prices and their sales Sales are really, really great. Next up, Synapse has announced a standard release of the film Massacre at Central High. Now that one came out in a limited edition steelbook, uh, I think about a year ago or so. As much as I really wanted to get that release, I admit uh, the steelbook was a little bit too pricey for me, so I definitely wanted to wait for a standard release, and now we are definitely getting one. It is due out a little bit later this year. Uh, no retail price has been slated, but usually with a standard release, I mean, honestly, you can usually find them between like $20 to $25, depending. So I'm excited to finally be able to pick this one up. And as far as I can tell, it is porting over all of the extras that were also in the Steelbook. Coming on June 21st, The Film Detective has a new classic horror film uh, coming to Blu-ray. And that is indeed The Brain from Planet Arus. Arus? Am I pronouncing that? I'm probably, I'm mispronouncing that, aren't I? But that is getting a brand new restoration as well as a new audio commentary track by author and film historian Tom Weaver, David Schechter, Larry Blamire, and Planet Arus star Joyce Meadows. A new Man Behind the Brain director Nathan Nathan Juran, an original Bollywood motion pictures production, Man Behind the Brain, The World of Nathan Juran, as well as an introduction by actor Joyce Meadows. I have a full color booklet with an original essay by Tom Weaver, and I believe it's actually going to be in two aspect ratios. One, uh, the original 1.33 to 1 aspect ratio, as well as the 1.85 to 1 widescreen uh, aspect ratio, which was done a lot at the time as theaters were sort of transitioning into widescreen formats. So a lot of times you'd actually have films that would be printed in both aspect ratios, depending on where they were going to be shown. Retail price is $29.95, but it's uh, currently uh, up for pre-order on Amazon for $19.99. Probably, probably even go cheaper before its release. Next up, Screen Factory has a new uh, exclusive title available on the Shout Factory website of the movie Watchers 2. Again, I think that's another one in the Roger Corman library that they're releasing exclusively. Limited to 1,500 copies. Uh, it is available right now exclusively at shoutfactory.com. Doesn't have any extras, unfortunately, but it does have a new transfer. And then the other big title from Screen Factory coming July 26th is a new 4K release of the movie Species. And that's getting a new 4K transfer from the original camera negative, and it's going to have both the 4K disc as well as uh, two Blu-ray discs. I think the Blu-rays will be uh, pretty much identical to the previous releases as far as extras go, but the Blu-ray included will have the new transfer on it. So very, very exciting news, but definitely keep in mind that the included uh, Blu-ray will be Region A. Does retail for $36.98, but it does it is up for pre-order now, I'm sure. Uh, I don't know if it's up on Amazon just yet, you know, in places like that. But a couple places do have it up for pre-order. I'm sure the price will drop as it gets closer to release. And then finally, the one I am kind of really, really excited for. Not that these other excitements aren't exciting, they are, but definitely the one that really kind of made me want to sit down and for sure make a video right now is Vinegar Syndrome has announced that it is uh coming later this year, a new 4K release of Toby Hooper's The Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2. So me you know, it's definitely one I've been wanting in 4K for a while. In fact, some buddy of mine, uh, I think they're sick of me <laughs> kind of saying like, God, I really hope we get uh, TCM2 on uh, in 4K soon. Vinegar Syndrome did officially announce it. It's been kind of rumored for a while, but it wasn't really sure whether that was gonna be Vinegar Syndrome or possibly Kino. Uh, like somebody had it, but no one, I didn't, you know, I was hearing different things as far as who had it. So happy it's Vinegar Syndrome. Now they did a post uh, in regards to their upcoming sale, which is at the end of the month during a Memorial Day weekend. I will cover that as we get closer to that sale. But in that post is where they drop the news. As you can see, 
you from the final paragraph of the post. If you're saving up to become a halfway subscriber, we're ready to welcome you to the club with our biggest and best second half of the year ever. We hope you're looking forward to plenty of slashers, gialli, and regional weirdness, as well as UHD premieres of horror masterpieces such as The Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2, which I am super excited for. That should look fantastic in 4K because that had a very unique uh, visual style to it. And honestly, it's just one I really want in 4K. So it's like, you know, it's a win-win there. Obviously, the no details now. I'm, I'm going to guess that maybe that's either going to be the big October title or it's going to be their big Black Friday title. Don't know yet. They haven't announced that yet. But obviously, they did announce that it is indeed in the works. So that's it for this news update. I definitely have a lot more stuff to get to, including uh, actually another pickups video. I'm just waiting on uh, something to come in. And actually, uh, my Screen Factory uh, 4K release of Escape from New York has shipped. So once that comes, in, I will do an unboxing because I did get the bigger bundle and obviously I love everything Escape from New York so you know I had to get it. So keep an eye out for that one probably in about a week or so. I think it's still in the you know label created stage but definitely let me know your thoughts on these announcements and as always thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.